Howdy, folks. I'm out here bright and early. And see, I got Jacob with me back there because Jacob was insistent that uh, we needed to catch trout this weekend. So he got up early as hell, left, uh, drove to my house, got there about 5.30ish, I think, in the morning. We took the hour drive up here to the dam. You can see it behind me. And uh, I guess we're going to catch some trout with any luck. Hopefully it's a little better than uh, it was last time I was here. Wasn't bad last time, but it wasn't great. But uh, we're still kind of waiting for some sunlight to come up, but I think we're going to get started anyway. We can see well enough. But uh, according to what I've been hearing, uh, there's been, been kind of cold at night these last little while, and that's kind of got the trout fired up. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start off throwing sort of some new stuff. But... Uh, yeah, probably going to switch back to rooster tails eventually. Just do what we know works. What do you got to say? Got a rooster tail. Well, we yeah. know it'll work. <laughs> there we go. So we're going to head down to the water, try not to break our ass, and uh, get to it. All right, we've made it down the rocks. We're out here. We're giving it a go. Fish are jumping around. I think it's going to be a nice morning. I've got my 7-foot-long ultralight ugly stick, my little reel with a 10-pound braid on it, and a uh, six pound mono leader. And I am starting off with this fancy little jerk bait. Now it's got little single barbless hooks on it, which is fine because you gotta be barbless here anyway. Single hooks kind of iffy, but this little thing cost me like $20 or something, 15, 20, something like that. Got it from Japan. I'd love to tell you what it is, but everything's in kanji, so I have no idea. I was just told that it's, uh, it's all the rage over there for catching trout. And well, I buy dumb stuff. We're gonna see if it works. There's a little one chasing it. It's too close to shore now, but it, there was the first cast, a little one chased me all the way like three feet in front of me. So, Problem is the way trout hit, it's so hard to tell if they're there on a jerk bait. I think I'm gonna have to work this a little bit quicker because it seems to just sink. Or if I just straight reel it. Got one. Oh, he came off. Barbless single hooks. Don't catch as many fish, but uh, you know, you don't kill as many fish either, which I don't generally kill a lot of fish anyway, so I don't think that's necessarily a concern of mine. Oh well. Hmm. Seems after uh, those first two takers, no one seems to care that much. All right, well, caved in, did it, got a rooster tail. Got a six ounce black and brown with a gold blade on it. Jacob's throwing lighter colors already, and he did get one hit, but not super interested. So I'm gonna try some darker colors here. Let's see if maybe that'll work. A gold blade on it. Not worth it. There's a fish. Yep. So I tried because your light ones weren't working. Not a great fish, but. Yeah, maybe. Yep. There we go. First fish of the day. He's not a spectacular fish, but he's a fish. I'm getting wires out here. Bet he's gonna flop because I'm holding the hook. He's gonna stab me. That's my prediction. Hold still, I'm working on it. Give him a little the dangle release here. There we go. 
There you go. I know you can see him. He's going off. He's fine. He's cool. All right. One enough. I thought you had two. Oh, one the other one came off on the barbless hooks. There's one. Oh, he's got a little fight to him. I'm only gave up now. Must be a rainbow coming right at me. I guess you got me. Time to fry me up. Stop rolling. Yeah, a little bit better than the last one. Eee, got it down in there a ways though. I don't, yep. Well, shit. Well, I don't think this old boy is going to make it. I got it out pretty nicely. Get him back in the water quick. And upside down. Well, he, he swam off, so he might be fine. There's also an old uh, rooster tail thing in the water here. And uh, now I got blood hands. But hey, two fish, and it doesn't seem like that one's going to die, unlike the last fish I bloodied up out here, which is immensely surprising for trout. Now, how do I get into this water without falling into it? Yeah. There we go, that worked. No, oh, yeah. You need a black one or something? I got a black one right here. All right. I mean, there's plenty more of this river. We can we can kind of pop around it and go down. Got one. Oh. All my too. Ooh, we can show off a different trout for once. Decent size too. Look at that. beautiful colors. Nice. Yeah, I got those red dots on him. Nice. Browns are nice. I don't get them very often. I pretty much only catch the browns and the brooks in this big pool in here. Well, we were uh, down there fishing for about two hours. Between the two of us, we caught three fish. I at least hooked one on uh, my fancy little Japanese lure. So, I mean, I guess it was worth the money. I didn't lose it, so it's got fish potential. But we're going to move spots because okay. goddamn spiders get out of the way. Whatever. Yeah, we're, uh, we're changing spots because I didn't catch nearly enough fish. We didn't, uh, we didn't wake up so damn early. Well, I was already awake. But Jacob didn't wake up so damn early so that we could not catch fish. So where do you think you want to go? You want to go to the golf course? Yes, sir. All right, we're going to go to the golf course. We're going to catch a bunch of tiny bass. Maybe, if we're lucky, a good bluegill or crappie. But looks like tiny bass it is. So we'll see you there. All right. Didn't have a ton of trout to catch. So we've moved on to one of my fallbacks here, the golf course, where the water is real low. We're going to see if we can catch a fish or two. Man, that water's down probably five feet. That may be real good for us. I don't know how good it's going to be uh, with me throwing this crankbait. But find out. How many golf balls do you think we can find walking around right here? They're normally all underwater. I see a couple. Yeah, there's quite a few right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
just out of reach. Yeah? A lot of golf. We got tournament coming around. So. Ah. Did y'all catch anything? We just got here. What about if we go on that little stretch? Yeah, if you stay over there on that, that levee side right there and don't, if you go, you can't really go up around that the green there. There's a green over there. Yeah, okay. So basically, kind of. Where it gets thick right there on the edge. Where all those trees are kind of yeah. yeah, right through there. Kind of right through there if you wanted to. Okay. Well, what about uh what about on the island? I know that there's nothing really going on there. Yeah, if you if you get over there uh between golf right there at that green, uh you can walk right there across the bridge. There's a little bridge. Okay. Just past the green, then you could get on that island. Alright, well okay. we'll do our best to stay out Let's the way. Go over there. That way, maybe we can actually catch something today. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Thanks. <laughs> Hello, tiny bass. I was pulling it out of the water and he came up and grabbed it. So the key was, I was talking to you, so you were distracted. Yeah, I was looking at you. These sticky hooks. Oh, like. yeah. Like I said, I was pulling it out of the water. Well, he ain't big. But he's a fish. That's what we came here to do. Catch oh, fish. Yeah. Well, definitely can, uh, there's definitely bigger bass in here. But it's just the water's so low, it's weird. So I really don't know where they're gonna be. I'm just kinda throwing wherever and hoping for the best. But hey, they're here, they're biting. Hibachi's still okay priced. Or not hibachi, uh, wasabi's, wasabi's. It's still pretty all right priced. It's not great, but it's okay. I ate that a good amount because it's uh, close to work and I can get it delivered. Uh, your brother John is too good for that place. Just FYI. What? Wasabi's? Yeah. I took him there once um, when he was in town, um, probably back when I was still in college. Uh, this is when he kept living in. I think. Yeah. Oh, when he was a bigger snob? Oh. Oh, wow, yeah. On your stupid little spoon thing. So I took him there, and he looked at the menu, and he saw it, it didn't have real crab, and he's like, I'm not going to eat here again. I'm never going to eat here oh. again. Here, maybe I'll show you the fish without talking shit about someone. The, so especially the one person who consistently watches the videos. Don't, don't put that on there. <laughs> oh, I'm absolutely putting it on here. <laughs> Sorry, John. I still love you. It was a long time ago. John he's knows some, that I think he's a snob. He's got some fight. It's a good... The sushi's good. It's imitation crab. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's strong, man. Yeah, they're not big, but they're feisty. You gotta get the selfie. Prove to the wife you're a man. Mm -hmm. Alright. Well, I'll keep trying to catch a fish. We're one-to-one -one here. Yours is bigger though. Jacob's on a tree in the sky. I'm on a tree in the water. We're having us a good old time here. Oh man. Maybe about to lose this damn thing. I don't think I can get in there close enough to grab it. Come on. 
maybe I can get the rod in there enough to just kind of yes Ugh. and I didn't fall in got close Oh, I watched this little bluegill follow it up and I just stopped it on the surface and he came up and bit at it and took off. What's up ducks? Oh yeah? Ah, you're cool. All right, later. There we go. Yeah. Well, there it goes. <laughs> Camera was giving me some troubles, so I don't think I actually got any of that. Oh. Well, we got plenty of green sunfish in the camera. Yeah. Well, I don't need any more green sunfish. Yeah. It was almost 10 o'clock, though. There's a fish. Okay, so it's. Whoa. There we go. Oh, I just cast over you. Yeah. A little bit. A lot of mud. Gonna have to drag them up. Come here, bud. In your mouth. Got them on the outside. Yeah. My second fish second and a half because I lost the one earlier another bass but back he goes a little surprised not really a lot of fish in this area too much as far as I've been able to tell fishing it for so long that may have been a fish Yes. Yeah. Yep. It's kind of my strategy. I got a bit like right here too. Uh, I heard you say they were fishing a couple times. We are out of everyone's way. They can just suck it up. I don't care, bro, but you shouldn't be out here. Yeah, right. This guy's blind in one eye. Yeah. Get this damn hook out of him. There we go. Back you go, buddy. Try to find a real fish next time. Hey, you got a stick again. I'm cleaning up these water. Probably a golf ball. You know, they, they hit them with such force. They're real confident in their bad shots. There we go. I think it's the bluegill. Oh, yeah. Out, That's green. He was under the tree. Classic summer fish, although it's not technically tall. Technically. What? Got two types of fish now. 
Nice little green. I don't know. He seems he might be a type of hybrid. He's got a really bluegilly body. Greens are normally a bit longer. There's a fish. Yeah. Getting some pretty okay bass for this pond lately. Not too bad. Him. Uh, that is not a regulation catch, therefore, it does not count. A fish is a fish. That is true. I thought he felt kind of funny. It tells me that your neighbors would be the kind of people that I I've met some pretty alright people that live here, but. They were also out fishing on the golf course and like, don't walk over here. No. I just sunk pretty far. Now, if you bought a house on a golf course, you'd think you're fishing. Yeah, I'd go around up. I probably sunk about eight inches. This will be the last fish. Jacob's broke off and I need to go home and go to bed. This is actually a little bit funny because you see that stick right there? Yeah. I threw it at the ones behind it and then it caught that stick and flopped off of it and when it flopped off he came up and grabbed it. And these hooks do not like to come out. I mean good for keeping fish on annoying for getting fish off there we go yep don't flop out of my hand don't grab the back stop it last fish of the day out to be a pretty all right day didn't uh we didn't do quite what we wanted i mean we did catch trout so we did do a little bit what we wanted but uh it kind of took a turn different than what we had expected yeah that sounds better but yeah we got to catch all kinds of stuff today green sunfish rainbow trout brown trout largemouth bass it's a pretty good day i think what do you think i always have a backup plan there we go. With that, we're going home because I've been awake since 4 p.m. yesterday. It is currently 11 a.m. today. And I got to go to work tonight. So uh, we'll catch y'all next time.